Danny, thanks for joining us. Right then, definitely your last season. Yeah, definitely. Um, you know, I've really enjoyed my time at OKR. It, you know, it was something I'm really glad I did. Obviously, I, you know, loved my time at Leeds, but um, you know, going to OKRs, you know, give me a, a fresh lease of life, really. But um, you know, I think mentally and physically, it's, it's the right time. I'm, I'm determined to, to to have a really good season this year and, and finish on a high, and it's an exciting time. And uh, but yeah, it will be my last year, and uh, you know, looking forward to having a big one. Still enjoying pre-season? Yeah, it's, it's been good. It's been tough, and um, you know, I've got some great people working at, at Rovers, and they've looked after the old body, so you know, I can't complain. And I think you ask most players, they just want to get into the to week to week grind. Once you've done, you know, eight weeks pre-season, you're just looking forward to playing. And uh, obviously, there's no bigger game than the derby first up. What a start for you, Hull Derby. Yeah, it's uh, it's brilliant. You know, I missed missed all three games last year. Couple through suspension and one one injury, so I never got to a sort of sample the atmosphere. And um, you know, I'm really excited about that. I can't wait to, to to get into that game. Obviously, it's at Craven Park as well, so you know, we'll have a great following behind us. And uh, yeah, it's a, a great way to start the season. What do you think the whole can do this season, Ed? Um, yeah, I think we're, we're quietly confident. I think our recruitment's been really strong. Um, you know, we lost a few players at the back end of the season, but um, you know, probably lost. You know, quite a few numbers, but added added a little bit more quality this year. So, um, you know, there's a quiet confidence within the camp, and uh, you know, we're excited. And I think the competition, you know, is going to be really close and intense. But you know, I think we can surprise a few people definitely. Is it tough in some respects going into your last season? You know, this is going to be, you know, last time you walk into the dressing room, etc. Last time you walk out at, you know, wherever. Yeah. Is that is that going to play on your mind this season? I think that's just what I'm I'm looking forward to more than anything. I think you know, playing against you know you. Your Wigan's away and your Warrington's away, knowing that it's potentially going to be your last your last game there, and um, just just sort of embracing it really, and and, and I'm really determined to to enjoy the season and uh, not get uh, like you say too emotional over things. Just just go out there and enjoy it and try and play play as well as I can for for Old Kingston Rovers. Try and savor the occasions. That's it. Just just savor the occasions, and you know I've obviously had a you know a pretty good career. I've been playing you know first grade since I was sort of 18, so. Uh, Body's, body's struggling, and uh, but you know I'm just going to try and go out there and just just enjoy it and, and do my best for the team. Got to ask you about your old club. They're going through a, a massive change again, Leeds. Yeah, they are, and you know I think they've they've recruited outstandingly. They've added some real quality to the team, and uh, you know at the top of the tree is the coach with Dave Ferner. I played with Ferns, and you know he's going to you know add a lot to the team, and I think he has he already has in you know such a short space of time, and you know I expect them to be you know much stronger than they were last year. You're going to enjoy your last season. Then? Yeah, I'm determined to. Anyway, you know, I think um, the week-to-week -week pressure of rugby league, you know, it can become, you know, it can get on top of you at times. But um, yeah, like I said before, I'm determined to embrace it this year and just, just enjoy my last season.